Hi, my name is Dr. Bryony Kaur. I am a technology analyst with ID Tech X. I cover 3D printing and I'm here today with Nicolas Bernardin of Ceradrop, who is going to talk me through some of his technology and his printers. Hi, Nicolas. Uh, hi, uh, Bryony. Uh, so we are there presenting our advanced technology uh, in terms of digital printing machine. So we are providing the market with advanced technology, starting from pure inkjet printers, but also hybrid uh, digital printer that combine both inkjet and aerosol jet from Optomic. Right, okay. So what are the main advantages of printing with this printer? So the main advantages of this uh, printer is that you combine lots of technology in one single tool. That is to say, in one single standalone platform, you have everything required to print lots of application areas, starting from uh, inkjet printing, but aerosol jet printing with different type of substrate. And in addition to that, you have the capability to cure different uh, multi-material components without removing the substrate from the machine and then finally characterize two-dimensional with camera, three-dimensional with laser reflectometry okay. and also physically uh, with four-point probes you can have uh, sheet resistance uh, measurement. Right, okay. So what is the resolution that you can print down to? Uh, so it's uh, resolution down to 10 micrometer with uh, aerosol jet, uh, 25 micrometer with inkjet. Right, okay. Um, and you developed your own software to support this multi-material printing? Exactly, we are providing uh, these printers with a different, uh, a complete dedicated software suite that permit uh, people to start with any type of 3D CAD file that will be importing in our advanced software suite and then uh, they will, the user will be able to tune completely his printing strategy in mm -hmm. order to reach final features. Right, okay. So what is this printer that we're looking at here? So today on this printer is uh, an example of uh, flexible electronics. So we are depositing a nano silver ink on uh, paper, uh, so live demonstration during two days of exhibition launched um, in terms of uh, circuitry antennas printed, mm -hmm. cured in line and then characterized with four point probes in terms of sheet resistance measurement. Right, okay. What other kinds of materials can you print on? So as soon as we are uh, dealing with flat substrate we can print on any kind. So it can be flexible uh, polymer foils, paper, glass, wafers, ceramics, metals. Right, okay. So a wide range of potential applications then? A wide range of applications, yes. Uh, because of the versatility of the process, uh, his flexibility as a digital process can adapt itself on lots of situations. And uh, yes, a real, real wide range uh, in monomaterial, multi-material applications, but also two-dimensional and three-dimensional ones. Okay, all right. Okay, well, thank you very much, Nicola, for your time. Thank it's been you. a pleasure. Yes, thank you very much. Thank Have you. a great day. <laughs> Thanks. Bye. Bye.